Hi, I'm Jordan from Kettner Creative. In this video, we're going to show you how to set up and connect the Focusrite Scarlett 2i2 audio interface to your computer so you can connect to a Zoom meeting for a video conference or anything like that. The same steps that we present in this video will be necessary if you're using Office Teams or any other video conferencing software. This video will work for you as well. So in this video, we have the Focusrite Scarlett 2i2 audio interface. We have the Audio-Technica AT2020 microphone, which is extremely popular for live video streaming or video conferencing. I prefer this microphone with its optional windscreen on it. I find that this helps with plosive protection and some sibilance. It just makes the microphone sound better to me overall. Uh, but other than that, we have a couple cables and headphones and things like that. If you want pricing or specs for anything that you see in this video, please check out the description below. We do have all kinds of links on where you can find all this if you're looking to purchase. So the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna tip this up and we're gonna connect it to our microphone. So I'm just gonna connect the XLR cable to the bottom of the microphone, connect it to the interface, just make sure that everything's turned down on it. Connect the headphones to the interface. You can do this in any order that you want. Normally you'd probably have the USB cable already connected. I just wanted to be able to turn this up uh, so the overhead cam can see when we plug everything in. So now that all that's plugged in, we can connect the USB cable to our computer. Plug it into the computer here, and that should work. So we see the lights on this device coming on now. You can see that it's getting power. So one thing, this is a condenser microphone, so that means that we do need 48 volts of phantom power. I'm gonna click that on. In terms of monitoring, I'm gonna leave the single circle on. That means that we wanna hear any input that we plug into this device coming out of both ears. We don't wanna separate them at all. Next, I'm gonna put my headphones on. Now that my headphones are on, I'm just going to turn it up a little bit, and then we're going to increase the volume of the preamp for this microphone. So we keep turning it up, check one, two, one, two. You can see here now that it just went red a little bit. You want it so it's mostly green when you're speaking into this microphone. I'm just going to turn my headphones up a little bit better. So anytime you speak, it should go green. If it flicks yellow for a second, that's okay. Uh, it just lets you know that you're getting close to clipping, but I think it's set pretty well here. So over on the computer, now that everything's connected, I just Googled set up a Zoom test meeting, and then the, I got to this page here. This way we can join a fake Zoom call, test all our settings ahead of time, make sure everything's working. I'm gonna show you how to do that here. It's gonna ask if we wanna open Zoom, and we do. Obviously, if you don't have Zoom installed on your computer, now would be a great time to do that. So you can see here, we wanna join with video. And it's asking right away if I hear a ringtone. You can see under speaker three here, it's already kind of selected the Scarlett 2i2. I can hear it quite well in my headphones, so I'm gonna hit yes. Now it wants me to speak and pause. I do hear a replay, so I'm gonna hit yes. I'm gonna join with computer audio, join with computer audio. So now I'm using the computer audio, like it says. I'm just gonna open up these audio settings just so we can see and double check everything here. So you can see here when I'm speaking normally that it is in the green whenever I'm speaking. If you want, you can try cheat it just a little bit more, but I'm pretty happy with how loud it is there. That's really everything that you need to do in order to test and set up this device with Zoom. So again, I'm just gonna hit test speaker here I can hear it perfectly in my headphones. It's a great volume. My monitor is at, 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 my monitor is at exactly 50%, so I have tons of headroom to adjust. I think I'm ready to join a call. If you have any questions about any of the steps in this video or any of the settings on the device itself, again, you can use the optional air uh, feature on the Scarlett 2i2 if that's something that you want. If you hear any hiss right now, the fan on the laptop is working pretty hard just with the screen capturing software and Zoom and all the settings that I have on it right now. So that's probably what you're hearing. So if you have any questions about anything that we've done in this video, please leave a comment in the comment section below. If you want links to anything that you see in this video or want to see pricing, we do have links in the description below. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, please like 
and subscribe. Thank you for watching.